My neighbors are outside. I hope they don't hear me. Hi guys, it's Ella. So I am doing my Booktubeathon update for day four outdoors again because I just spent 20 minutes running around in a ridiculous dress for the challenge thing, which I'm not even sure if I'm going to put. I'm sure, okay. I'm sure I'm going to post, but it's ridiculous. Just fair warning. So stay tuned at the end of the video for that. Now for what I read today. I actually fi finished Fables by Bill Willingham. This is a little hit or miss for me, but I'll talk more about it in my wrap up for the whole booktubeathon. But so I finished this. I enjoyed it. It was, I mean, it was okay. It's, it's really hit or miss though. That's the only problem. Currently I am in the process of reading Lumberjanes and actually I just realized this. This is created by all women. Um, so it's by Noelle Stevenson and Grace Ellis, Brooke Allen, Marta Laiho, and Aubrey AZ. This I am enjoying quite a bit. It's really colorful and it's really fun. It's about girls at camp and it's it's pretty good, I have to say. It's actually super duper quick to read, which is probably my favorite part about it. So I'm about two thirds of the way through this. I mean, give me another 15 minutes and I'll probably be done. So I will be finishing this tonight. I also read like another 30 pages of Black Ice by Becca Fitzpatrick. This is just not keeping my attention. The story, I don't know. It's just not what I expected, I guess. I think it could be good, but it's a little bit weird. I will, I do want to finish this before the end of the booktubeathon, so I'll probably be finishing this tomorrow, but I might not, to be quite honest. My other reading plans for tomorrow are actually pretty ambitious. I have to go back to school shopping, which kind of sucks, but you know, whatever. So the first one I have, and these, I'm probably not going to end up reading all of these, but I will probably end up reading one of these, just because there's three. I'm just going to see what I feel like. This is Ms. Marvel, No Normal. This, I mean, everybody talks about this. This is about a girl superhero. I have heard really good things about this. The art looks really well done. Or I'll be reading Low, Volume 1, The Delirium of Hope. And this is done by the same guy that did Deadly Class. And I absolutely love that graphic novel. So the art is really pretty and the style seems vaguely the same as Deadly Class, so I'm probably gonna pick up this, or I might just pick up all three of these. Ow, mosquito! Seriously? <sighs> Bastard. And the third thing that I might pick up is Lock and Key, Volume 2. Um, this is by Joe Hill. This is a little bit sick and a little bit twisted and a little bit dark. See, even the art is really dark. I did enjoy the first one. I wasn't like thrown on the floor by it. It was really violent, but we'll see how the second one goes. Obviously from the library, as you can see from the sticker. So these are my reading plans for tonight and tomorrow. I'm gonna go edit and upload and stuff. Stay tuned now for my ridiculous movie. My trailer, or yeah, I guess my book trailer is for The Madman's Daughter by Megan Shepard. If you've read this book, you might find it amusing. If you didn't, you might find it amusing. Either way, it's me making an ass of myself, so enjoy. Also, let me know down below how you're doing on your reading challenges and what you're planning on reading for the last day, and I will see you tomorrow. Have a good night. Bye. Hey! What's that? <laughs> <laughs>